everybody welcome on my channel and in today episode I will try to make a bowl from this crotch of walnut this is this crotch looks like that a lot of spaltings on every side you may see but also I have a lot of uh, cracks on it uh, after drilling the hole for mortise, after uh, straightening up the surfaces and squaring this on the pencil, I found that the bowl inside has a big crack here, is going here and going out here. So for sure, I don't know what is inside. Uh, this is the crack, main crack, the whole uh, hardwood is falling out it's not the hardwood now it's more punky than the soft wood on the outside uh, so so i decided to make a bowl from it using the, those veneers of from the u it's a self cut it self sanded it uh, veneers a bit cracked on the one side so i decided to make veneers from this not the board for uh, wood for uh, segmented turning and and what i will try to make i will just to try to split the blank uh, two straps i will put here and here and when it dry after gluing i will flip it and make two straps here this should keep the blank in the uh, correct place and I will get five millimeters more <laughs> on, on the, of the dimension. Uh, it's not too much, but always something. So let's go to the pencil, cut this, slice it, slice it, slice it, slice it, whatever. Let's go to the pencil. <laughs>
and the blank is on the lathe as you see this crack ugly crack i catch this here twice and here is crack, keep it uh, twice again i hope it will work i don't see any bigger gaps on it uh, i will start shaping from this side this will be the bottom make it round uh, i got to drill a worm for worm screw but uh, this side is not so hard i think and some parts would to felt off uh, so so i will start in this position and with this position and and on the end i will use a cold jaws to straight it up the bottom i suppose it will be the best choice to make it what the shape it will be i have an idea but i don't know how the wood will be working with my gouges if there will be a lot of tear outs i will leave a normal round shape if not i have an idea uh, but the wood must work properly and i have to avoid tear outs if it will be possible so let's start it Okay guys, ball is sanded up to 400, it's not perfect sanding because the tear outs but not on walnut but on you appeared, <laughs> so I will uh, seal the wood as a sanding sealer using a shellac and burnish this with uh, shavings, I hope it will help.
and okay bowl looks like that I applied a shellac on it and uh, polish restoring axe paste but I think I will have to add one coat of shellac because not every place is shiny especially punky places let it dry a few minutes then I will flip it on the cold jaws and remove the tenon the mortise 